Madrid is one of Europe's most cosmopolitan, energetic, and intriguing capital cities. Its culinary landscape is a melting pot of numerous cultures, faiths, and nations, all representing Spain's evolution through the years. Madrid's gastronomic history began at the end of the 16th century, when King Felipe II relocated the capital city from Toledo to Madrid and established it as the new core of his empire. This shift resulted in waves of mass migration from around the Spanish Empire, with many different people bringing their unique cooking skills and preferences to the capital. As the city evolved, it adopted new habits, which resulted in developing some of its most renowned meals, many of which are still quite popular today. Welcome back to Town Travel Tips. In today's video, we are going to discover the absolute must-try dishes when in Madrid, the capital of Spain. Remember to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are a curious traveler and want to learn more about beautiful cities and traditional recipes worldwide. Already done that? A massive thank you! Let's dive into our trip between Spanish delicacies. Number 1. Jamón Ibérico Jamón Ibérico, or Spanish ham, is an upper-quality pork cut, seasoned and cured with care for several months before being sliced and served pretty much in every restaurant in Madrid. Jamón Ibérico is PDO protected, which means that any hams bearing the designation must be derived from black Iberian pigs. These pigs are allowed to roam freely in oak woods, feeding on grass, plants, roots, and acorns. The hams are all salted and cured for two weeks after being butchered. They are then cleaned and dried for a further four to six weeks. Curing takes at least a year, while some manufacturers cure their hams for up to four years. The red and marble color will leave you no doubts about the attention this product gets. And the flavor? Sweet, fat, but balanced, will remain impressed in your minds for quite a long time. Locals eat jamón at room temperature and with their hands rather than forks and knives to preserve its natural taste. Number 2. Patatas Bravas Patatas Bravas are typical tapas from Andalusia, but over time this dish got inserted into every menu in Madrid, preserving the original recipe though. This tapas recipe is made with twice-fried potato cubes topped with a spicy tomato and garlicky sauce. When the potatoes are soft and fluffy in the center and the edges are crispy, they are sprinkled with sea salt and rosemary and served as aperitif or appetizers. The key to this dish is not the potatoes, although double-fried, but the brava sauce, made by mixing tomatoes, sherry vinegar, onion, garlic, chiles, paprika, and fresh herbs that all together give a strong umami flavor. For a snack or appetizer, patatas bravas will always be worth a try. Number 3. Paella Yes, paella is from Valencia. Yes, there are many tourist traps that serve a bad paella in Madrid. And yes, you might still be interested in trying it while vacationing in Spain. So we have you covered. Paella is a traditional Spanish dish made with rice, meat, vegetables, or fish, depending on your tastes and the seasons. The base of the recipe is prepared in a big flat pan with rice, peas, stock, garlic, tomatoes, white wine, and paprika or saffron. Try to avoid the most touristy restaurants, which can be easily spotted by photos of food on the menu and servers at the door that are inviting you in and look for traditional restaurants, preferably from Valencia, for your perfect paella, often served for a minimum of two people. Number 4. Croquetas If you eat your way around Spain long enough, you'll notice that there is no shortage of varieties of Spanish croquettes. Croquetas are basically a fried mix made with bechamel and whichever ingredients a given tapas bar decides to add to it. There's a croqueta for every taste, 
from wild mushroom to mint, and peas to salt fish. But nothing tops the basic version with local cured ham, often the very same jamon iberico we already talked about. They are similar to the Sicilian arancini, a slightly bigger fried street food snack available in southern Italy. The similarities might hint that both recipes had an Arab influence, being that the Arabs were present both in Spain and southern Italy. As a quick lunch or an appetizer, they will not disappoint you. Number 5. Churros Let's close our list with a sweet note. Churros are a typical Spanish dessert made of fried dough comprised of flour, water, and salt. Spaniards exported churros to America during the 1500s, while from there they took back chocolate home, creating the topping for the most common recipe nowadays. Churros with chocolate are a popular breakfast in Spain, served usually before 10 a.m., but they can be found as street foods on several restaurants' menus all across Madrid. Are you wondering which bonus food will be featured in today's video? We decided to go with Bocadillo de Calamares. It is a very simple dish made with deep-fried squid rings put into freshly baked and crusty bread. Nothing fancy to see here, but just pure Mediterranean taste. Served on the go, this bocadillo will be your quick lunch between one sightseeing spot and another. It can also serve as your snack before dinner, because locals here tend to eat very late into the evening, even after 10 p.m., so you might need a refill before dinner time in Madrid. Have you ever been to Madrid? What are some of the best dishes that you came across? Let us know in the comments section. There you have it. Those are the best dishes you should try while in the Spanish capital city. You should also check out our video on how to spend 48 hours in Barcelona and get the most out of your weekend getaway. Did you find this video helpful? Hit that like button if you did. Subscribe for more and click that bell icon so you don't miss out on our next videos. Thank you for watching. Take care. Ciao.